This video contains rude words such as bugger and fuck. Hello and welcome to Nikki and Bunty and this week we are Sweary Snes Girls. Cue the music. <laughs> So I started to look for um, rude words in SNES games. As you do. As you do, because that's that's just what I do. Um, when I've got time, I search all of the SNES ROMs in the world for words like fuck. And bugger. And boobs. <laughs> and piss flaps. And other things. However, I could only find two SNES ROMs with rude words in them. I, I know that Nintendo are very family friendly. They have very strict content guidelines, so no rude words, um, no sexual content, no religious content. Mm -hmm. um, which always surprises me when I, when I read how strict they were on, on that type of content and what they let Takeshi's Castle get away with. That's true. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did find two ROMs which had fuck in them. <gasps> Scandalous. I know, I know. It's, and you can tell how little I swear from every time I got to say fuck, it's a big thing. <laughs> Whereas I'm just like, oi, cunt. Lots of cunt. So the two ROMs were the Lawnmower Man and Unirally. And the, the list of words they had in them, they had lots and lots of swear words in them. And it was all related to putting in your name in the high score table and naming your characters. <laughs> so they wouldn't let you name your character shit, for instance, because that has a bad word in it. And the bad word is... Shit. That's right. Of the two ROMs, a uni rally would not allow you to have any of the following words in your name. And even worse than that, you couldn't have any of the words in any position in your name. And the list of words is... Shit. Fuck. Damn. Bastard. Cunt. Ass. Bottom. Twat. Butt. Wank. Prick. Licker. Dism. Jizz. Face. Crap. Piss. Penis. Head. Bloody. Hellfire. Bitch. Stiff. Erection. Knob. Sphincter. Rectum. You can't include the word breath on in your name in Unirally on the snares. But you can include the word cock. So it made me wonder, what else can you get away with? How creative do you have to be to defeat the swear word filter on Unirally? Let's find out. Cock. Piss. <coughs> Minge. Bellend. Scrote. Fanny. Felch. <coughs> Lesbo Poopcock Queef Titty Bum Titty Knob So Bunty, I've just noticed something that there is an O there and there's a zero and they look exactly the same What if we put in a zero instead of the O? Frothy. Skeet. Skeet. A new fragrance by Calvin Klein. Crevice. Vagina. Pussy. Taint. Clam. Mufflips. Bush. Gooch. Squirt. So I guess after all that we're going to ask in the era of non-internet games why bother putting those things in because if kids know the words they can say them anyway they can just write them on the bedroom walls why go to that bother because they're easily and hilariously defeatable yeah, and to be honest, if I 
if I'd had this game as a kid and I tried to put my name as arse and I couldn't, I'd then go, well, I'll try bum and I'll try cock and then I would try every single dirty word I could think of until I got one through. It would be a challenge. Not much has changed now that I'm in my 30s. Another amusing thing about that is the people who made the game were DMA Design, who went on to become Rockstar North. It's almost as if um, <laughs> they were so, I don't know, so repressed and they were trying to be really good and then all of a sudden it all came spilling out in the form of GTA. <laughs> it's a little bit like a ah, self- Nintendo wouldn't let us say poo. They wouldn't let us say fuck old bugger. So let's murder prostitutes. I was going to say it's a little bit of a of a self-comparison, trying to be a good girl and keep it all in and it all came spilling out, but I promise you, I haven't killed any prostitutes. And you can't prove it, one way or another. And on that bombshell, <laughs> <laughs> it's goodbye from us. See you next time. Okay, love you, bye. That was a wonderful experience. <laughs>